All right, ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to One Game One Life. My name is Typo, and this is Pal World Part Forty Three, Days Eighty Five and Eighty Six. And I do want to just bite the bullet, and if he can't get here, I'm just gonna move the crusher. Do you have this? Does he have this? Uh, he's working on this first, but I'm okay with that. Oh, is he eating? <laughs> My bad. Is he still eating? You're overtired. You're confusing me, man. I need to know whether this is working or not for you. Are you able to do anything right now? I just don't know. I don't know if he's doing jack. Thank you. There you go. He can get back here. That was weird that he wouldn't move before. I guess he got stuck or something? Oh, he's really proud of himself. Here we go. Get on it. Make it happen. Yes! Okay, good. Alright, I'll keep Jormantide out then. He's so much better than Sir Fence. So much better. I was just worried that he couldn't fit and I got impatient. I don't know why I did that, to be honest, but we'll move on. Alright, back out to the volcano we go. We've got work to do, things to see, uh, berries to cook, because they need food in here for sure. Four hundred fifty berries would be excellent. Uh, there's the fried eggs if they need them. I'd rather they didn't, but you know, if they need it, they need it. And the cake's done or no? It is not done. What a shame. Alright, we'll put this away then. And come back another day for that part. So this huge scorching egg should be done in a minute. I should stay for a minute, I guess. These, this 52 minute egg will hatch today, the huge dragon egg will hatch today, the rest, we're gonna have to wait for the next episode. And by today I meant this part, this episode. <laughs> okay. Palladium fragments are a problem, we're still working on pal metal ingots, apparently they take some time. Which is fair, I guess. Maybe we have enough charcoal now? I just want to make all the carbon fiber, you know? <gasps> you go drive, but we'll help with this, please. 150 more carbon fiber. Nice. Yeah, and all these Anubis are amazing workers, but they do take a lot of food. Not pancake amounts of food, but a lot of food nonetheless. <clears throat> okay, we've got good pallium fragments going through there. Alright, here we go. Huge scorching egg. An eighth blaze howl knocked. We will take that. That's a win in my books. Put another egg in. Excellent. Hey, Grimus. Okay. More stone. Good. Hyperspheres are good. Pal spears are trash, but you know, it is what it is. Alright, uh, Paldium Fragments. We need to make more spears before we leave. Um, we do have 30 Ultra Spheres, which is fine, I guess. But it's not great. Yeah, just pour all the stone into it. Just pour all the stone into it. We'll get it figured out. That's fine. We can bring that over to where it actually belongs. And with that many Pallium Fragments, we should be able to make more stuff now. We have a bunch of spare ingots that I need to find a home for. And I think that home is just going to end up being... Um, ultra, uh, hyperspheres. Because Hyperspheres are pretty good against a lot of the lower stuff. But I don't know, man. How much lower stuff is there? 
Whatever, we'll make these for now. Yeah, we'll make these for now. I just realized we're going to need more wood. I forgot that these all take wood. Alright. Let's head out while they're working on that, I guess. What's, uh, I, he makes these fast, doesn't he? Oh, yeah. Drivable cooks on this. Minus 15% work speed, be damned. He's level 32, so he's getting up there. He's starting to get more relevant level-wise. But I want to see if we can explore the rest of the volcano in this episode. Um, <laughs> there's probably no way that happens. But that's the goal. That's the objective. I'm going to wait till we have uh, the final sphere before we do Jet Dragon. I'm probably not going to wait till level 50. Because... We don't, we don't really need to do that, necessarily. You're doing a great job, Drivable. Oh, he's so shy about it. <laughs> Alright, let's hit it. Alright, back to the breath of Ever the beach of everlasting summer. Oh! Lux is probably healthy now. Uh, you know I always remember after we've already left. But that's right, this is the crazy fast swap yeah that was that was lightning speed all right quiver and where are we going yeah. oh god for ignis we do need that pocket burst hopefully a gigasphere is enough let's see yeah. That might be asking a lot. Let's just go to hyperspheres, maybe? Yeah. Yeah, that's so much better. As, as from, like, components it takes to make to capture rate, that was just so much better. <clears throat> that's four of those now. We do need more Ragnarok as well. We need a lot of things still left on this volcano. Whoa. Swing and a miss. Quiver, swing and a miss. Um, crossbow, I guess. Yeah. 32, huh? Yeah. Is this an ultra sphere? Please get in there. Nice, thank you. <clears throat> Triple brittle, oh boy. Absolutely stellar. Alright, we've already been here. Is there anything up here? Just gotta check the map. There's an effigy down there I missed. Not the end of the world. I think I remember mentioning that effigy, now that I think about it. We were talking about how we could always get it if we ever needed it. Because it's right there, next to the fast travel. Hyperspheres are good enough for incineraps. Good. Damn it! I was not ready for that kind of like AOE. Oh, nice. Okay. Wasn't really expecting that to work, but okay. The one I expected to work break broke out, and the one I didn't expect to work stayed in. So go figure. Back to the crossbow, in case it gets out. Nice. Already making really good use of everything we've brought with us. Here we go. Oh, you dirty rascals. Dodging that water attack. Come on now. Don't be like that. Oh my good god. Good god. Thank you. Oh my god, it happened again! The AoE from the Dragon Cannon ruined our catch. I was counting on it at least holding a little bit. It was an Ultra Sphere. Artisan Ragnarok is great news. We can put that in next time we visit the base. 
Damn it, though. Not going how I planned. Okay, don't go directly over lava. Doesn't matter how high you are, you will still burn. Keep that in mind. We gotta play around that weird, janky, early access mechanic, because there's no way that's what's intended. Wow, this really went high, didn't it? It did keep going. A lot of sulfur if you wanted to farm sulfur. No thanks, I'll just buy my ammo, because making ammo is a lot of work and resources, and I'd rather just not. Leave me alone, bandworm. You don't want this smoke anyway. Oof, look at the range on that attack. How many Cinerams do we have now? Seven more Paladium. Look who's stuck, sucker. Oh wow, the crit. Oh my god, what? What was that da- <laughs> what was that damage? <clears throat> Confidentness! Oh shit. Yeah, I definitely killed that one. That was my fault. Lost track of damage while I was dealing with the other one. That one's on me. And we are just now getting to the point where we're about halfway to 47. Okay, we've, we've discovered a good chunk of this map. We're doing it, we're doing it. We'll get Jet Dragon later. A later date. This is where the cool door was, right? Not a door, but like it looked like a door from far off. No, it was right down there. That's where it was. I want to make sure it's not a door. I'm almost positive it's not, but you know, better safe than sorry. Yeah, right over here. I can't believe you get set on fire for flying 80 feet over lava. That's so bad. Yeah, that's not a door. That's not an entrance of any kind. It just looks sick. Okay, alright. <clears throat> I'm sorry. Uh, but that does answer my question. I'm happy with that answer. Let's keep going. Let's keep grooving. We actually, the way things are looking, we might do a lot of Mount Obsidian today. We didn't do this section because we were in trouble. I didn't want to risk it earlier, so we can keep going this way now. So much sulfur on Mount Obsidian if you were the type to make your own ammo instead of buying it. That's like the number one most annoying thing for me to make. I don't know what, what it is about it, but it just feels bad to make all those refined ingots and then get only five ammo for all your work each time so I, I will stick with just buying it until I'm out of money I guess because we are quickly bleeding money buying that ammo <clears throat> I just felt really good that we finally had something we actually wanted to buy in the first place There's nothing else over here, right? Nothing I'm missing? We'll come back here for Jet Dragon one day? I believe so. Oh, a card! And a ton of ore if you wanted to set up here, right? Okay. Oh, with this wall here? Set up in the corner? Oh man, that that's really cool actually. I'd be all about that to be honest. That is really cool. You could 100% set up a defensive base here up against this wall. Axel Travers Diary 1. Who is Axel Traver? And how many Ragnarok's do I have? Eight. Hey, these two would finish it if I managed to catch both of them. Oh yeah, yeah, I can't aim that thing. 
Oh wow, we're further away than I thought. I guess, well, I guess I'll take the chance to do this. There you go. Light him up. Do I still only have the one's attention? Interesting. I'll throw one hyper, but I'm gonna use an ultra probably. I was afraid to attack because I thought I'd kill it again, but nice, got it. All right, the last Ragnarok we need is right here. With a great per catch percentage on the Ultra Sphere. There it is, Ragnarok's, Ragnarok's complete. Getting almost 20,000 experience for some of these catches. That is a really cool area to set up base. Nice in the corner there. Jet Dragon right outside. For better or worse, you could farm Jet Dragon if you wanted him. I'm assuming it's not Jet Dragon, right? No way it's Jet Dragon. It's Jet Dragon. Like a Jet Dragon combo. Gotta be. And this just keeps going, so I'm gonna follow this lead here. This ancient, these ancient technology walls have me super interested in what, like, the history of these islands are. Because it would take a lot of effort and technology to make these. I'm assuming these aren't just stone. They look metal to me. Hopefully that gets answered at some point. Or at least, like, they really milk the mystery. I don't know if they do anything like that in early access, though. That'll get fixed one day, I'm sure. Flambells? We're good without flambells. <clears throat> it does keep going. This, this thing is up here, dude! Is this the highest point in the entire game? Other than on the world tree? Because we're looking down on everything. Maybe that other mountain is just as high, but... Otherwise, we're looking down at everything here. We're not even at the top. <laughs> I don't know about this. Astagon 48. Oh, boy. <clears throat> well, let's go this way. Now that I've found the end of that wall... Is there anything on the end of that wall? No. Okay. Astagon 48. And a bunch of sulfur right there again. Is that ore or sulfur right here? I want to I wanna sweep this right here. Yeah, once you do the perimeter of an island, it, it it gets a lot faster clearing it all out on the map. Another Reptyro? That's 100% another Reptyro. Let's nab it. That's ore, not sulfur. Okay. What are you doing all the way over here, Reptyro? You're in the middle of nowhere. There's nothing, anything remotely near this part, this part of the world. What are you doing? Crazy move. Still needing our stamina back. Dragon cannon so free. Uh oh. oh. I was afraid of that. As soon as I let that go, what a waste of time. Five flame organs? That's nothing. We have over, we have almost three hundred of those. We didn't need flame organs. What am I doing? Entirely my fault though. Entirely my fault. The wall dis the the like area descends so fast that even when I'm trying to descend on Quivern, you still can't descend quick enough. As long as you keep moving forward, of course. More flambells? 
Don't need them, but thank you. Imagine we die now. Imagine this is where our one game, one life ends. Uh, it could actually happen at the next tower, though. That, that level 25 boss at the Free Pal Alliance Tower, level 25 and it was that strong, that could end up being a problem for us. Okay. So we've gone that direction now. Oh, another statue. Is there a summon there, maybe? I don't know. Let's find out. Yep, huge dragon egg, I figured. Excited to see what that gives us. I'm glad I made nine in egg incubators instead of the three or whatever we had. Because we needed more, for sure. Brother of the Eternal Pyre. Another Reptyro, I'm fine with that. We need more of that anyway. We'll use Ultra Spheres because these things have really low catch rates. 69, the chosen number. Come on, baby. <clears throat> Get in there, stay in there. The dramatic pause. Got it. Oh, man, we're going to go on fire going over that. Man, there is. Okay, I guess we're just going to go on fire. That's so strange, man. Why is it like that? I did not want to go all the way around. Seventy three. Get in there, stay in there. Oh, you bitch. Sixty one? That's so much worse. Because he was wet before or something? There we go. Serious. And conceded. Nice. Good combo. I guess I'll keep to the ground in this area. We don't need another Pyron, so they should run away, right? Those things should run away from us? They're not running away from us. Oh my goodness. Stop. Leave me alone! I don't want to play! I don't want to... Is that a blaze howl? Stuck on a tree. A tree branch, no less. That's another Reptyro. Okay. Uh, do we need another one of those? We need two more of those. Yep, we're gonna take that to the face. What? Hold up, stop. That's two Ultra Spheres down the drain because he's stuck in a wall. I need to make sure this connects. There you go. God, that sucked. That sucked so much. Bummer. Slacker. A useless one, too. Give me night soon. Oh, no! Not like this! It's surrounded by lava, so I'm getting burned again whether I like it or not. Oh, man. Alright, fine. Let's go. Ow. Oh, wait! 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 Oh, my God! Actually, get back on it. Get back on it. What? That lava needs to get fixed. That needs to get fixed. That is unacceptable. There's a fast travel there. That is unbelievable and unacceptable that that's the way that works. You take damage as if you're running on the lava, if you're flying above the lava. I'm afraid to move from this very spot. 
petrified to move from this very spot. Because if I accidentally end up over lava, I'm dead. Oh my god. That actually just happened. This is back at the foot of the volcano. Okay. Oh my god, dude. That is so jacked up. That is so jacked up. Well, now we know. Not only does it set you on fire if you fly over it, but you also... Oh my god, I'm surrounded by bandworms too. But you also take damages if you're running through it if you fly over it. Oh my god, pocket pair. Get on that. What the hell? That's insane. That's insane. Get me out of here. That was so scary. That was... Oh my god. I had to commit. I couldn't stop or turn around for a second. Or it could have gone so much worse. Wow. That was crazy bad. Well, okay. Moving on, I guess, next time. Put it the volcano. Let's make more spheres. We're going to need them. You're doing great, Kremus. Excellent. Your Jormantide your actually get, slept there? That's awesome. Awesome. Alright, seven and a half minutes on that egg. Put this here. Stone. Megasphere add to the inventory thing. Oh, yeah. Paldium. Duh. Wow. That scared the hell out of me. Wow. That scared the hell out of me, man. I can smile now that I know I survived and it's over, but I did not like that at all. No way. No way that's real. What? Oh, sorry, Drivable. You don't need to do that. 20 pound metal ingots, yeah. Thanks for all the carbon fiber. <coughs> Pal metal helm, there it is. Best metal helm in the game, which we will wear after this refined metal helm breaks. But we have it now. Complete. Well done, drivable. Um. Could do the legendary giant feed bag now. Because we don't have that yet, do we? Nope. Might as well. We were going to have to do it at some point. 50 wood, 200 fiber, 50 leather, 20 carbon fiber. That's our first legendary gear. <laughs> Very anticlimactic first legendary gear, but legendary gear nonetheless. Finish that while I put these in the bookshelf, please. Bookshelf? Bookshelf. Oh, come on. I really thought I could do that through the wall. Oh, ah, well. Seems to be a good worker. Oh, yeah, not drivable. The, the one in the base. Got it, got it. I was like, he's... I mean, he's Anubis, so yeah, but also, no. He's an 85% worker, which is plenty enough for being in our party as a fighter okay uh, da, 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 da. I don't think there's anything else <clears throat> wood is the limiting factor right now on that 26 more ultra spheres would be wonderful we can't do that though we'll do this because we need 20 refined ingots for repairing things here and there and a hundred refined ingots for the weapon assembly 2 eventually. So we'll do 20 ultra spheres, and that's where we'll have to stop. And hopefully, we can make enough pal metal ingots to start actually making some good spheres eventually. That's big. 75? Hell yes. 
Oh, we're totally gonna start doing this, man. We're totally gonna start doing this! Legendary Spear is starting to come up here. Not too bad, not too bad. Everything's coming together. Uh, I'm gonna put the Pal Metal Helm away for now. So 150, 350. 100, 250. Okay. It's decent. It's a decent upgrade, but it's not like, oh my god, gotta have it right now. Upgrade. There you are. Yeah, because we only need 100 for Weapon Assembly 2, right? I didn't mess that up. Yeah, we only need 100. Perfect. Do need 10 circuit boards. Which we can make right now. Oh, we gotta make polymers first. Yeah, yeah. Which we need high quality power oil for. I need to go buy 80 more high quality, 40 more high quality power oil. Welcome, ladies and gentlemen, to day 86. Basically two weeks away from our first hundred. Days complete. Wrong guy. Sorry. I, I will be spending a lot more money on you. Just spent like 150k on you earlier, but not actually what I'm here for this time. I need your high quality pal oil. 40, please. I actually have one. I might not, so let's spend 12,000 on 40. They're eating eggs. Oh no, I need to go put other food in. I love our base, by the way. It's just so right. It's so it's just it's just come together so well. Four more. What's the limiting factor here? Flour. It's always flour. There's your cake. Well, female not present. What happened? I, t I took the Tombat out. Duh. Why am I surprised by this development? Okay, Lucky, Serious, Stronghold, Strategist, Earth, Emperor, Runner. They're both male, though. Serious stronghold strategist. Hmm. We need better female Anubises. Does the cake never expire in that chest? Because if so, I'll still leave it there. It looks like it stays at 20. Yeah, okay. Sure. Uh, drive will finish that, please. And then, what else did I need to do? Jormantide just works from there, huh? Yeah, I'm gonna replace him eventually, but for now that's fine, I guess. That just looks so awkward to me. Well, our socks is hungry. He's... He's stuck somewhere. Oh yeah, the feed box. That's what I need to reorganize. There you go. Go eat, big guy. 451 baked berries are complete. There you go. Okay, they're eating eggs somewhere else, then. That huge dragon egg about to be done once we finish these polymers and these circuit boards. Because then we'll have the circuit boards that the circuit boards that we actually need to... Yeah, we did have one. Oh, well. To actually make the weapon assembly line, too, when we hit 47. Might as well plan ahead while we're here. You guys are crushing that. Well done. <clears throat> one of our eggs okay eight seconds here's the hoping huge dragon eggs are pretty good A Yormantide Ignis! Legend says the Yormantide Ignis was once a warrior who, after being wrongly convicted and cast into a volcano, returned as this pal to destroy those who wronged him. That is sick. Nice. Sadist Masochist. Okay, what is what is Yormantide Ignis? Level 4 Kindling! Oh, God. 
Stormbringer, Lava Dragon, Enhanced Fire Attacks while mounted. Dude. Wixen, you've been replaced. It's alright. Thanks, though. And it's actually a normal size Dormantide. So, that fits so much better than an Alpha one, dude. It's still massive, but it actually fits within the walls, you know what I mean? That does not fit. That We need a normal Dormantide eventually, please. These are all huge rocky eggs. Oh, yeah. They're either going to be great Anubises or they're going to be condensation material. Either way, it's going to be great. <clears throat> okay. To the foot of the volcano. Right? No. We were doing this. Thank you. And then circuit boards. We were making ten. The amount of pure quartz we've had here, actually working for a long time. Like, that one trip of pure quartz might last us the whole game. Which is weird. Why even bother putting it in the game at that point? But, okay, sure. Oh, he can't reach the electric furnace because it's inside. Can Yormantide, Yormantide probably can't fit in here. I might have to move the furnace. I might, I might. <clears throat> but okay, okay. About two-thirds of the way to 47, so we won't be making this weapon assembly too for a while. Thank you, Drivable. You're doing an excellent job. But now we have it when we're ready. Still have 72 pure quartz left. I still have 15 hyper, 41 ultra. That's going to have to work. That's not bad even. Not only is it going to have to work, but it, it, it probably will work. As long as we don't run into, like, you know, these level 48 and 50 bosses that we just can't catch. Because <laughs> we need the greatest sphere before we can really do that. We got the level to do that, but... Yeah, why didn't we ever go up this way first? This was the first fast travel we found. Yeah, the foot of the volcano is the first fast travel we found. Why didn't we do this earlier? Whatever, we'll do it now. I'd say screw it, we'll do it live, but this is recorded. Like a week before you'll see it, to be honest. Uh, I think this video comes out on February 19th, and I'm recording it on February 12th? Yeah, yeah, a week a week beforehand, because I'm just playing so much and I don't want to stop. <laughs> I hope you all understand. Oh yeah, yeah. I could start doing three episodes a day, but nobody can keep up with that. That's just too much content to watch. So, not only is it always going to make sure that something there's something new to watch to a day for a long time, but um, it'll give me. The break I need, because at school right now, there's a lot going on, and I'm playing so much Battle World, I don't have time for other stuff, so that'll work out. Hello, hello. Leave me alone. Damn it. You asked for this, just remember that. You chose this fate. Try lightning. It dodged. Get out of here. You chose this. It didn't have to be this way. Alright, is this going to be another black market merchant? That's usually what I find in places like this. Whee! Ah, oh, this might not be a black market merchant. This is still going. Oh, oh god dang it. <laughs> Place a month. Oh, 49 Curse Tyrant is a little low on the health, to be honest. Maybe doable? I just used Lux, yeah. but we don't need all of his shots, I guess. Okay, Blaze of Mutt, let's do this. 13 damage, that's not a lot. Maybe he's got low health but high HP. Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. I did not want to get hit. That's a shame. It didn't go the way I wanted it at all. Lightning Streak, nice paralysis. 
We have done less than 300 health since we started firing. Oh boy. Okay, let's go. This guy's nice and big. I can't miss this one. Nice. Woo! Oh yeah, look at that damage. I actually do more damage than my pals now with the assault rifle. Go get him, Joker. Dude, that was like 200 damage, right? 10 damage each for 20 bullets? Yeah, let me watch the HP number this time. Oh, maybe not. It's a lot of damage, though. Ooh, whoa, 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 whoa. Yeah, that good damage. Yes, sir. This assault rifle is so good. Oh, God. Doing great, Joker. This guy's so much easier to hit than Anubis. Good thing, too. Uh oh. That probably would have cooked us. Yeah, that's doing so much damage. I love it. I'm missing some of the shots, though. I can't keep wasting assault rifle ammo, it's so expensive. Alright, Joker, hit it again. 31. Okay, good. That'll work. No shot. 1% with an Ultra Sphere? Why? What? He blocked it? Come on. Please, just give it, give it to me. Way luckier than the Anubis Flame Emperor. Hell yeah. Pyromaniac. Absolutely. Legends say it was born. I'm going to read it. I'm going back to it. Hold up. Uh, where are you at? Here you are. Legends say it was born during a volcanic eruption. A strange group even claims that this continent is laid upon the back of a giant blazemut. Yeah, okay. Level 4 mining and 3 kindling? Oh my god! The pals you can find at the volcano is insane. Is this supposed to be the last area you go? Was I supposed to go to the sand dunes and the, and the frozen, like, mountains first? Because this is wild to me. Yeah. This is absolutely bonkers. How good the things are that you can catch here. Oh god, he's set on fire. The lo it's, it's all too- it's too cramped. It's too cramped. The lava's everywhere. Just- just stop. Just stop. I got it. That is crazy. That is crazy. Wow, I'm definitely using him. 100%. No questions. No questions asked. He's getting in the party. Or he's getting, he's getting in the base at home. He's going to be doing work. Level th four mining and three kindling. Four mining! That's, that's so fast. So now we have the level 4 Kindling, which is Jormantide Ignis, the level 4 Watering, which is Jormantide, level 4 Handiwork, which is Anubis, and the level 4 Mining, which is Blazemut. So we have four level 4 workers just kind of out of nowhere, just because we finally decided to go inwards in the volcano. Really what it comes down to. Wow. Man, there's this huge stretch of black on the map. I don't want to miss anything. Yeah, we don't have any of this. Let me make sure I'm not missing anything over here. Before we come back, because there's obviously stuff to do here. Let's make sure we don't go directly over the lava. Doesn't matter how high we are. I don't think this will be anything. I'd be shocked if this is anything. But I guess I missed this little area.
I can see how. There's nothing here. Ragnarok, but we already have all ten of those now. Ooh, wait a second. Oh, that's a staircase up to the Anubis. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, we've 100% been here. Okay, going back. Going back. Let's see what we can find on day 86, the rest of it. Things have been... These last episodes to record, going, like, kind of inwards on the volcano here, hatching Anubis, facing Jormantide, really, every episode since we got the assault rifle has been so cool. I can't wait to see what Astagon is like, the level 48, or Jetrag in the level 50. Which makes me just now think that there's a 48, 49, and 50 alpha on this island. Which really makes me think this is the endgame island. Hopefully I didn't do this stuff out of order. I suppose before we do the tower I could look at the other, like, areas. Make sure I'm actually ready. Um, those Lee's Punks are not supposed to be standing in that lava. Not very smart of them. Why even have these, like, little jump pads? If you're just gonna burn me anyway. You know what I mean? I don't trust any of that. Absolutely no shot. I'm going around. I'm going around. You can't... Okay. <sighs> There's an effigy there. Shit. Nope. I don't care about that effigy. I, I don't. You can't make me go over lava. Not with how... This is a one game, one life run for an effigy that I probably don't even need. Nope, you can't make me. I'm moving on. Uh, rest, please. Thank you. Alright, and then we keep going. I'm not going over that lava. Ain't no way. There's no reason to go over that. There's no reason to go over that. Then there's this lava over here. This is the lava that we were almost dead at, right? Yep. This is the lava that almost killed us. Super fond memory is there. Okay, this this might be unavoidable. Okay, that, that part doesn't count if it looks like that. Good to know. Good to know. We still need one more Reptyro, I believe. Yep, alright, that's the last one right here. Let's lock it down, let's grab it. Uh, with the hypersphere, maybe? Because it is only level 34, here's the hoping. Always manages to hit Quiver. Somehow, some way. And Quiver's so big, Quiver can't dodge anything. <laughs> 39. Go with the Hypersphere. Or the Ultra Sphere. 78. Really good chance. There it is. 10 Reptyros. Heated body. Fitting. Not very helpful, but fitting. Okay, you can set up a base here too, I guess, if you wanted to. I don't know why you'd choose here of all places. Tower right there, we're getting close. But you could. It's an option. <clears throat> Especially, isn't there a fast travel somewhat close? Yeah, it's right there. Mount Obsidian Midpoint, what a name. Yeah, there it is. I knew there'd be a way over to this without having to fly over to lava. I just never should have gone on that middle structure there. That middle island right there, I should have never gone on that. 100% not worth it. Okay. There it is. The Mount Obsidian Midpoint. <clears throat> we explored a ton of this island today. That's the 48. Okay, let's keep moving. I don't want to go home yet. Still got stuff we can do. We still got spheres. We're full health. Nothing to go back for at the moment. Gonna go a little higher over this, just in case it matters. But luckily it doesn't look like it burns you if it's this area. Nope, it does. Okay, so you just need to be way over it, because we did fly over one of those earlier. So you just need to be miles over it, is what I'm hearing. Like, not even remotely close to it, and then it'll work. 
Leave me alone. You don't gotta burn nothing. <clears throat> Let me be. Thank you. Alright, here's the wall we've gone to before, so now we've gone everywhere. We've, we've done the whole trek here. Ragnarok produced four cake. Nice. I don't know how we were supposed to get up here, but we're doing it this way, I guess. The 75 pal metal ingot. Jormantide Ignis was able to reach it. That's good to know. Oh, shit. Okay, yeah, we really tested fall damage with Quivern on that one. <laughs> oh, no. I almost dismounted to activate the glider to try to um, prevent fall damage, just in case. But because my reaction speed was too late, I was like, nope, don't do it. We're just going to have to have faith in Quivern. And Quivern did not let us down. We love it. Does she have the stamina to get up on this wall here? Surely she's got this. Yeah, she's got this. God, she is big. <laughs> she is a really big dragon. Some of these pals in this game are just absolutely massive. Like, Pokemon does some big Pokemon. Digimon did some big Digimon. Temtem does some big Temtem, but... Pal Worlds made some absolutely enormous pals. <clears throat> Especially when they're bigger because of Alpha and Lucky. I love this game, guys. I love this game so much. Because there's still so much to explore. There's still the Cold Shore... Frost Mountain area, and there's still the set the desert sand dunes to explore, even if we finish the volcano soon. And then there's the tree, the world tree, Yggdrasil, whatever. We get to go solve that mystery. We haven't even done half the tower fights yet. We've done two out of five of the tower fights. Which is scary, because, you know, Quiver needs food, okay. I'm glad they tell me. Have some bread. Drivable. Bread. Joker. E fried egg. Lux. Okay. And then there was 25. Okay. We're almost there. Getting there, getting there, getting there. Oh, wow. Wait, I went past Astagon? He must be in a cave. Which would make sense. This this volcano place seems like it's it's cave heaven. There's the tower. I'll grab the fast travel since we're next to it, but I'm not going in that tower right now. Kelpsy Ignis, what are you guys doing all the way up here? Wait, is it up there? No, it's not. Ascon's not even in that direction. Kelpsy, you don't want the smoke, okay? Brothers of the Eternal Pyre Tower. A faction we didn't even know about till we got to this volcano. We don't need more Reptyros. We're good. Okay. This is probably where we'll pick up exploration next time. Which means next time we'll have to finish the volcano. We're, we didn't quite manage to finish it today. But this should be finishing up soon. 10 minutes on some of these, but... Oh, wait. There's one at 1 minute 30. Nice. Norman Tide's way up there again. Very cool. Alright, we have 75 pal metal ingots. Which means if we get more palladium fragments from uh, Norman Tide, then we should have what's required. Let me drop these. Let me drop the coal, just in case some weird dropping through the floor things happens. I do not want to lose these palmetto ingots. The Ormantide Ignis. The absolute kindle. And then we need to get um, Blazemud out here for sure. Look at the Anubises. Including the really big one. Nice. Nice and nice. This is just an instant deposit. Uh, 140 more. I should keep some stone for when we need to make cement and stuff. Let's put Blazemut in over Arsox. Um, Arsox is great, but not 
blaze him up great, you know? Blazemut is going to be an alpha, so he's going to be fat. But here he is. Let's go, Blazemut! Four mining, three kindling. What a beast. Okay, here we are. Legendary spheres! And we can make three, because we don't have enough cement. That's exactly what I was worried about. Alright. But those are our first three legendary spheres coming up. Need more cement. Which we're running out of PAL fluids for, starting to get concerned. Being honest. <gasps> They're making those legendary spheres pretty quickly when Anubis is working on them. Oh boy. And some of them fly, don't they? Shoot. Uh. Drop the coal guy. I'll be back. Driver will come back here. Okay. The Ormontide's there, ready to go. They're on their way. Could buy rifle ammo for the mounted machine gun, too. Oh, hey. I'll take that. I'm out here just picking up all the Palatine fragments now. I didn't know I was going to need them so much earlier. Get them all together. Launch them the other direction. We're doing this. We're doing this. Well done. Well done. And when they start to get past us, we can use lightning strike. Yeah, let's go Lux. You're a unit. No one gets in. You're only allowed to die. I do want that Van Worm crit. Chris. Uh oh. Killed it. Uh oh. Lightning streak? Nope, they're dead too. Enemy's been defeated. Well, I tried. <laughs> we'll, we'll catch him somewhere else. Alright. <laughs> Whoops. That's fine. Good defense, Lux. Five copper keys? That's a little overkill. Man, Lux is just like that. Absolutely. You get him out of here and just let him fire away. We need more food before we go. And I need to save Jormantide from himself. Go ahead, dismount. Nope, go ahead, dismount. Do it. Do it. Dismount. You can do it. I believe in you. There you go. Let's get rid of this furnace here. Ooh, didn't know that was going to do that to me. We just don't need the primitive furnace anymore. Come on, get me over there. Okay. Paldium, palmetto ingot, stone, yeah, yeah, yeah. wood. Alright, let's open that egg up. Grab a new one to replace it with. Thank you. Here it is. What kind of Anubis we got this time? How much we cooking? Serious Stronghold Strategist Lucky. That's a great worker. It's a great worker. Is it a female, though? It's a male again. Damn. <laughs> Damn it. Yeah, we already had a serious lucky stronghold strategist. Damn. Bummer. Okay, well, we'll keep trying. We keep rolling. Yep, okay. Uh, back to what we were doing before we got so rudely interrupted. Well, uh, we got the cements, good. Drivable. Legendary Spheres. We just picked up our very first one. This is as good as Spheres get, so if we face something and this Legendary Sphere says 1%, I'm going to cry. <laughs> I would cry. 
This is as good as it gets, and I'm at 10 capture power. Like, it, it literally doesn't get better than what we have as far as capturing things goes. Other than maybe using a stun baton at times. Boy, we need more cement. Boy, we need more cement. Hold up now. More stone, please. We're starting to be glad we have these. Glad these guys have been just cranking out the basics. Because we have been needing it. Nice. 722 more? Well done, guys. I can make a lot more cement with that. I don't know why we need cement for, you know, the legendary sphere that captures the greatest of pals. But, you know, we have it. Okay. Sure, why not? Okay. Now we have the stone to do it. Just drop it off in this box because it's about to go away anyway. Okay. Drivable. We're back on it. Cement time. Pal fluids was now the limit. Oh no, not pal fluids. <laughs> not the limit on pal fluids. We've had enough bones and pal fluids all game ever since we got that hot first hot spring down. Obviously there was yeah, there was that little point early game where we didn't have enough pal fluids and we weren't 100% sure how to get them cuz like, we hadn't really seen many pangolets yet. But other than that, we have never run out of bones and ping and pal fluids the rest of the game. Until just now. Bummer. <clears throat> Wonder how much they would cost to buy. I'm not sure. But I can't keep just buying things. I'm actually starting to run my gold out the way I'm playing. This way, drivable. We can only make four more legendary spheres after these eight. <clears throat> because we only had 20 more pal metal ingots. But I'm really excited that we're going to have, you know, like 15 legendary spheres. They look good. They look good. The pink spheres, huh? Uh, how much time is left? In the day? We're getting, we're getting close to 47 here. That weapon assembly line 2 is coming up. <clears throat> I don't know if we really need that, but... I did want to save the refined metal ingots for it, for sure. How are we looking at making hyperspheres? Because again, I don't know what we would possibly need ingots for. Oh, it's another day, isn't it? Yeah, everybody's up. Alright. Thank you so much for watching. If you enjoyed the video, consider giving it a like. If you really enjoyed it, consider subscribing. But either way, thank you so much for joining me on this journey in Power World. I love this game so much, it's unreal. It is so ridiculously fun to play. How the fragments are the limit. Okay. And I never want to stop. I never, never do. But unfortunately, it all comes to an end eventually. And we gotta go again next time. Run it back. Maybe day 87 or 88, we see the rest of the volcano. Um, I'd probably face Jet Dragon now, I guess. I know he's level 50, but now that we have legendary spheres... You know, maybe there's a chance that we catch him. Imagine throwing 15 legendary spheres at something and not catching something. 14, sorry. That'd be the ultimate heartbreaker, I think. Man. Alright, I'm gonna go drop this off in storage, and I'll see all of you... next time.